that's at the top of the focus. Now we focus down. Starting to see some detail inside. Definitely seeing two big dark spots in the top one and one, two, three, four spots, maybe five, in the left one. There's some more yet. And we're starting to see the little sprout coming out of the top. Now we're starting to see some diffraction rings around it. So we've gone through the center. Coming down, focusing through it more towards the bottom. Again, seeing quite a bit of detail. And now we're pretty much through it. So we're starting to back up. Here we go. And we'll know we're in the center when the gap between the cells is the smallest. Like right about there. Seems to be fairly clear right here at that gap. We've got some nice sharp dark lines around the spheres just delineating that little square gap in between the four cells. And we're coming up from the center. We're starting to see some diffraction rings around inside the cells as the part that's in focus it becomes only the top of the cells. We're getting to the point where there's nothing basically that we can see. We're, we're right at the very top and now we're above it. So I'll go through it slowly a few more times. Starting to see a lot of detail. There we are, pretty much in the center there. Yeah, backing up. There we go. There's the center. Now we're back through it. So here you can see the, the sprout at the top. It comes into a little more focus. But by the time we get to the center, the sprout, there we go. So uh, it's just a little before the center. The sprout is a little lower than the center of the spheres. And here we are up at the top again. And we go through, down. And let's leave it pretty much there at the center. <laughs>